Sirach, Ecclesiasticus 17. Yahuwah created man of the earth and turned him into it again. He gave them few days and a short time and power also over the things therein. He endued them with strength by themselves and made them according to his image and put the fear of man upon all flesh and gave him dominion over beasts and fowls. They received the use of the five operations of Yahuwah and in the sixth place he imparted them understanding and in the seventh speech an interpreter of the cogitations thereof. Counsel and a tongue and ears, rather eyes, ears, and a heart, gave he them to understand. Withal he filled them with the knowledge of understanding, and showed them good and evil. He set his eye upon their hearts, that he might show them the greatness of his works. He gave them to glory in his marvelous acts forever, that they might declare his works with understanding. And the elect shall praise his holy name. Beside this he gave them knowledge and the Torah of life for a heritage. He made an everlasting covenant with them and showed them his judgments. Their eyes saw the majesty of his glory and their ears heard his glorious voice. And he said unto them, Beware of all unrighteousness. And he gave every man a every man commandment concerning his neighbor their ways are ever before him and shall not be hid from his eyes every man from his youth is given to evil neither could they make to themselves fleshy hearts for stony for in the division of the nations of the whole earth he set a ruler over every people but yashadael is yahuwah's portion whom, being his firstborn, he nourishes with discipline, and, giving him the light of his love, does not forsake him. Therefore, all their works are as the sun before him, and his eyes are continually upon their ways. None of their unrighteous deeds are hid from him, but all their sins are before Yahuwah. But Yahuwah, being gracious and knowing his workmanship, neither left nor forsook them, but spared them. The alms of a man is as a signet with him, and he will keep the good deeds of man as the apple of his eye, rather the apple of the eye, and give repentance to his sons and daughters. Afterwards he will rise up and reward them, and render their recompense upon their heads. But unto them that repent, he granted them return, and comforted those that failed in patience. Return unto Yahuwah, and forsake your sins. Make your prayer before his face, and offend less. Turn again to El Elyon, and turn away from iniquity, for he will lead you out of darkness into the light of health, and hate abomination vehemently. Who shall praise El Elyon in Sheol instead of them which live and give thanks? Thanksgiving perishes from the dead, as from one that is not. The living and sound in heart shall praise Yahuwah. How great is the loving kindness of Yahuwah Eloheinu! and his compassion unto such as turn unto him in holiness. For all things cannot be in men, because the son of Adam is not immortal. What is brighter than the sun? Yet the light thereof fails, and flesh and blood will imagine evil. He views the power of the height of heaven, and all men are but earth and ashes.